All right, guys, how's it going? Kevin Fish is back here again. It's the, uh, I think it's the 11th of March. I've got my fishing pole here down at Kentucky Dam. I'm on my lunch break. I'm gonna throw this thing a time or two here. Even with all this crazy current, water moving wide open, uh, all the gates are still open. I believe uh, the app said it's flowing 165,000 cubic feet per second. Forecast it to go down to 156,000. So, but I'm gonna throw this thing here a little bit. We're gonna see if there's anything wanting to bite. So far, the signs are not promising. I've thrown, I don't know, seven or eight casts. No hits, no nothing. However, one thing I've noticed, first thing I've seen, first time I've seen it in uh, weeks, there's a boat way down here fishing. Hey, Kevin Fishes here. I'm down at Kentucky Down looking for the skipjack. Uh, I wanted to interrupt you real quick and say if you're enjoying this video, if it helps you at all, hit that subscribe button. And if you got buddies that like to skipjack fish or need bait for catfish, let them know about the channel. Uh, share it out there on your uh, social media with them. I appreciate it. Thank you. Well, nothing is hitting right here right now, but we're not going to give up. As I, as I get up uh, closer to the dam, I'll spin this around here. Up in there, the water looks a little calmer. I don't know, for the first 30 feet or so out. From here, anyway. So I may get up there and try. I'm going to get a little closer. See if I can cast up into that. See if there's anything up in there. As you can see, as I show you the water, it's uh, a little rough. guys there you have it uh, I've been down here for nearly 30 minutes uh, oh my camera says I've been recording for 28 minutes and not a bite I did uh, to show you what I was throwing here <clears throat> excuse me I've got two of these small feather jigs here I think these are 16th ounce I can't swear to it these were uh, in my cup holder in my truck but so that's just what I used and I've also got this one right here this curly tail grub which is uh, I think a quarter of an ounce I put him on the end but that may be a little heavy I don't know he's the heavier of the three uh, I've got two of those hair jigs there's one there's one and there's my curly tail. I put him on the end to be able to cast out a little bit further. I didn't have any colored jigs, but uh, as the, these are pulling through the water, I'm seeing them in the water just fine, so I don't think I need any chartreuse. I mean, maybe that would have helped if I'd have had a brighter colored one, but I didn't get a single hit. So I don't know, all I know is I'm here at Kentucky Dam. I've been throwing this uh, these three jigs here for uh, almost 30 minutes. And had no luck so i'm gonna say the skipjack are still not running uh, 
hopefully they'll be here soon i'll let you guys know when i know when i hear something else i will try and get by barkley later on this afternoon i've got to get back to work after my lunch break now but i'll try and get by barkley this afternoon and get you an update on barkley talk to you guys later all right guys i'm here at barkley dam got the fishing pole with me i'm not expecting great things here i'll show you what we're looking at it is still rough here much rougher here than it was over on kentucky pretty much unchanged other than the water has gone down some so I tilt the camera down here you can see we got about twice as much stairs exposed now as we had uh, when i was here a couple days ago the water's down probably five feet i'm guessing uh, there are a couple people down here today if you guys can see them over there but uh, they are bow fishing they're not uh, looking for skipjack uh, flow right now is uh, 85,000 cubic feet per second roughly started today at 110 according to the app so it has dropped we still have five gates open for the next two days so that'll get us through Saturday and uh, the, it's still projected to stay at 85,000 uh, on the upside we don't have any rain in the forecast we do have a little chance of snow uh, I don't think it's going to be much it's uh, I think they said one to three inches I don't know how much rain that equates to but I really don't think it'll be too much so with that being said I'm going to jump down here and throw these jigs for a little bit and just see if we get a nibble of anything I don't have high expectations but you never know guys it's so rough right here we're not accomplishing anything except me getting splashed constantly so walk down this way uh you walk down the uh, wheelchair accessible ramp for a little ways i'm gonna walk down that way and try it from uh, the, as far as down as we can go anyway All right, guys, I'm gonna hop over the concrete wall here and get down close to the water. I'm gonna leave the camera back here so it doesn't get wet. guys there you have it there's 20 minutes of throwing these jigs out here in this rough water one more view 
I don't know what was going on there for a minute. We were having look like four or five foot rollers coming in. I had to back up. I got splashed pretty good there one time. Uh, so no hits at all. 30 minutes over at Kentucky Dam on lunch. No hits. Uh, 20 minutes here. Well, let's call it 15 minutes here because I did get my my jigs got all tangled up and I had to stop untangling them. So we'll call it 15 minutes here. Uh, it's just too rough, too much current. Uh, I tried everything I could think of, you know, fast retrieve, slow retrieve. I let it fall. I didn't let it fall. I tried to jig it up and down some, moved it left, moved it right. Uh, everything you would normally do to try and get a strike. So I'm gonna, get, I'm gonna call it and say there's, they're not in here yet. But we should be getting close. All right, this is Kevin Fishes with your with another update. All right, well this is Kevin Fishes with another update for you on the skipjack here at Barkley Dam. We'll see you next time. God bless.